Dirty Forks! Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So, I've got another interesting bike. I think I'm in the presence of something that's rare. Given this bike uh, through the bike uh, community bike program that I volunteer at. And uh, he gave this bike to me to fix up and clean up and do what I do with it. So this bike is a Pinarello Antonio uh, Pava bike. So again, just like the Renegade build, there's not much I can find on this bike at all or mine. Um, and I find that really interesting. I like that. When I can't find stuff online, because <laughs> I, I, I think the general rule of thumb is that you can find anything online. The stuff that I did find is very interesting. So apparently Antonio Pavan um, was born in Italy, um, where the Pinarello factory uh, is where they build the frames. Then he immigrated to Canada um, and then he opened up a bike shop in Mississauga. And the bike shop is now closed, but I guess he dabbled in frame building for a little while. So this is the Antonio Pavon Pinarello house brand frame. Um, that he would sell out of his shop. It's, that's from what I understand. And that's from very fragmented facts on online. So we'll take from that kind of what we can and then go over this bike because this bike's pretty unique, pretty interesting. So, I'm thinking it's a 1990s Irish. Um, it's a rigid uh, mountain bike. Looks like a medium or a small frame. Technically this bike needs a paint job, but I'm not going to paint it. I'm just gonna clean it up really good. Check out these bars. That's all one piece. You know how you see those bull arm bars where um, you have on the end, it's you can grab them to go uphill or get some more speed or if you need a little bit wider. This is all one a one piece handlebar. This grip even is interesting and unique. It's all one piece. So I don't even know how I'm going to get these off of here. <laughs> I have to work on the shifters. Or maybe I might just work on the shifters on the bike. Because the, the shifters need... It's very, very difficult. They just need an overhaul. But yeah, I'm going to uh, tear this bike apart right to the frame. Cantilever brakes. Pinarello saddle, and the derailleur, and the crank. So the wheels are 26ers, and they're actually very, very light. And that's a seven speed. This is light alloy made in Italy. No other markings on the rims. Nice rims. I don't think they're double wall. So the hubs are Shimano Alivio Maxxis tires. This one is a Cobra, which from what I read, the Cobra is a rear tire only. There's some markings here on the, and this is a cassette. Oh, this is a cassette wheel. So there's markings on there. I believe it's a Hyperglide, so it's a Shimano cassette. This tire here is a Viper. Max's Viper, so it's the front tire, the front version. That is, from what I've read online, it's, it's usually paired with the Cobra. 
So we got the Cobra rear only and then the Viper front only. Very, very awesome. <laughs> I love this kind of stuff. And a little note there. It's actually Presta valves. So this bike, I believe, without knowing too much about it, I believe this bike would have probably been ahead of its time at the time this bike was purchased. So very awesome and uh, I can't wait to get into it. today than to finish this bike it's all cleaned up and it's ready to be ready to be rebuilt so it's about I don't know eight degrees outside it's like a spring day so I'm just gonna finish up the bike I think right now